Hey guys, okay, back for another video. So I did one sort of like on Friday and then on Saturday and on Sunday. So hopefully I'll be uploading my first one Sunday, my second one probably Tuesday, and one at the end of the week or something. So anyway, um, before I went away to London Anime Gaming Con, I was talking to one of my basically one of my sort of, sort of childhood friends who I've known for years, but it was like older than sort of like the group. It's called Michael Barrett. He's three or four years older. And I was at my nephew's crescent name, which is what he's sort of like related to as well. So we're sort of like related to each other, I just realised. Um, Inbreds, oh, why? <laughs> Everybody's related to everybody. <laughs> That's why he's now Cornwall, man. Um, yeah, and he obviously he just sees my, um, we're friends on Facebook, he sees me post about video games, and he mentioned he had some games and that, and he'll dig, dig them out for me. And this was probably about two months ago. Then he messaged me saying, I might have actually mentioned this, um, and he's got some games and that, and sent me some photos. That he saw like eBay, they were like two hundred pound, and they wanted one hundred and forty, one hundred and fifty. And I sort of replied saying that's a bit too much. If you look at completed listings, you get a better idea. And he said, "Oh yeah, it was a bit too um, overzealous on the price." And um, he messaged me just saying seventy quid. And I completely forgot that day. I had so many messages from people. I saw. I obviously, I looked at it. Obviously, on Facebook message, you like look at it, and you can see if someone looks. Cause sometimes when they send a set, some someone a message. They see it and then you think, why aren't you applying if you've seen it, you idiot? <laughs> and sometimes you're just like on the side there, just like looking through the messages and you're not even really paying attention. So I looked at it and, and didn't get back to him for about a week. So sorry, mate. Um, and then when I got back, I, look, I was just, was I born on the train or sign? And I was like, oh my God, I completely forgot. And a message was saying, you know, I'm away this weekend. Um, I've been really busy. Uh, is it still for sale? He said, yeah, I'll, go, I'll give you £60 and I can pick them up, you know, on Monday or Tuesday. And yeah, I picked up Monday, Tuesday. Um, it was quite late at night, and I just I left the stuff in the car. <laughs> I completely forgot. So I only just got them out just like now. I only just got them out now. Um, yeah, I'm pretty. I'm, I can't decide if I'm happy or not. So it was sixty quid. Yeah, I guess I am happy. Yeah, um, some games there I don't have. So let's start with this. He's much older than me, but I knew um, he's sort of like brother. And then literally everyone in the family. So, is this Revs? So it looks like Revs for the Commodore 64. Ollie and Lisa? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> fucking random. They are some random games that I've never seen before. Conquest? I don't remember that one at all. I remember Super Bike or Super Cycle? Super Cycle. But surely cycle is push bike cycle rather than it looks like a hang on clone. Green Bear A, I've definitely got that. Oh, so fucking hard. I had that on the Amstrad CPC. I had a green screen, I was like, oh, so hard. Winter Olympia. Limp up? Limp up? Limpad? Oh, I don't know. Olympad? <laughs> Winter Olympad, that's what it says. 88. God, there's still some bloody. Dust and everything. Um, I've never seen this one before, but this looks pretty cool. And it's Breakthrough, the arcade game. Okay, I think I do remember that one now, actually. Breakthrough, the arcade game. US Gold, 1986. BMX, BMX Racers. The good old Ghost Ghostbusters. I must have three or four of these, so I'll be taking this to um, Play Expo Blackpool with me. It's just like a random trade. Chill up. Okay, I don't think this is even a game. It looks like a. Macro. Macro. Macro Gene? Macro Gene. Who the fuck is Macro Gene? Automania. Hype Reloaded. Oh my god. So there's like no, there's no, oh my god, the back of doll. An eyeball. So is that the original eyeball pool? <laughs> god, I love eyeball pool. Oh, I've never seen this one either. Never even seen them. So there's some random games out of fuck. That's the random games. And it come with the Commodore. Controller. That's two of them. And another one. K 
Okay, so happy with that lot. But the main sort of wanted was another one of these. That was a Mars System 2. In really good condition, two pads, cables, power pack. So happy with that. I'm going to put some of this. And the games, there's a few games that I needed for my collection, which I didn't have. Okay. One thing I'm gutted about is R-Type. R-Type, which at the London Anime Gaming Con, um, Ian Wall brought, and it was oh, so good. I really liked R-Type, so he had it there on, I think he had like, he had a Mars system and it had an Everdrive in it, so you can just play all these randoms. I was giving the Ninja a go as well, oh, loving the Ninja. That's a really good, that's one of my favourite Mars system games, the Ninja. R-Type, no manual though, so I'm a bit gutted about that. I have to do two separate files. Sonic, which I've already got. My Hero, which I didn't have, so I've, I can't even remember playing it. But it's got no manual either. Zillion? Zillion? This does have a manual and it's a really good condition. Apart from the manual. <laughs> it's got Ryo. Couple of these cases, I think I'll be swapping out with my collection because some of them obviously some of the cases are broken. Marble Madness, which I do believe I have got. No, I haven't got Marble Madness. That seems like a really common game. Bomber Raid. These have actually got manuals. Which I do have Bomber Raid. And this one, I was like, God, even more gutted about this one. And it's Alex a Kid in High Tech World. So I've got the manual. Got the cartridge, but I've got no inlay. And something tells me I'm not going to get an inlay for it anytime soon. So really happy with them. This lot I don't have. So there's another another two Mars System games that add to the. I think I've got My Hero. Um, is it the the um, thing where we slot the card slot? I think that was on there. And I don't have R Type, but R Type's a really good game. Really enjoyed it. Um, yeah, so on to the next one. This did cost me £60, probably more than I wanted to spend, but there's some games that I wanted from my collection. I sort of just, I checked online and the prices, and someone thought, okay, I'm, I'm happy for this, obviously, have their game from my collection, and I know what I can trade in. Um, some Mega Drive games. Um, FIFA 97, absolutely garbage. Um, can't play that. <laughs> Mind Machines 2, Turbo. Turbo Tournament Edition. Good Key actually wants this one. So yeah, it's a good key. So I've already traded that all with Good Key. And Toy Story. So I've got those games, so I might just put them on a convention table if I sell them or don't. If not, I'll be I'll be bringing a selection of games to um to um Blackpool anyway. So it'll be worth worth the trades. And the other jobby is a Mega Drive. Not like I need any more box mega drives, but I thought, sorry, I might as well get it. <laughs> okay, box mega drive with Mega Games 1 sticker on. Probably the most commonest mega drive. And there's two control pads as well. There is one with like one control pad and one like Mega Games. I haven't even looked at it yet. So I was going to have lots of farmer, farmer juice because he's a farmer. Washing's giving it beads. <laughs> Completely forgot. Okay, I've got the manual, which is really cool. Cables. Oh, I've got Sonic the Hedgehog in there as well. Sonic the Hedgehog. Two controllers. Mega Drive. Oh, hello. And another two random control pads. 
What are these fuckers? Quick shot for professional players. Oh, they, they weren't in the... I don't remember them being in the photo. Well, maybe, I don't know. There's loads of dead flies in here. It's like farmer flies. <laughs> Crying. It's on my board game table. So, yeah. Some random quick shot pads. I literally never... It's been in the car all week. I've never checked any of this before I even do a video. Maybe I should. And, yeah. It's all there. I do have a spare one of these, actually. I might take to, obviously... The Blackpool. So if anyone's looking for an insert for a Mega Drive, I actually I've got a random spare one. I think someone gave me a Mega Drive, but it was just that. Or someone's got the actual inlay. Or whatever. So now I need to add um, Mega Games One to it, I guess. Which I think I've run out of Mega Games One because I bloody sold them all. Oh, it's gonna be a pain to put that back together. Anyway, I paid £60 for it, um, yeah, I'm happy, I'm happy, it's probably obviously you put it on eBay, that's probably what price it might sell for in the end, but really happy, some unknown Commodore 64 games I don't have, really happy with the Master System games, I'm slowly, slowly picking up the Master System games, um, what the hell, <laughs> sorry, <laughs> I didn't think they were fucking there, man. I always, do my, I always do my videos like in the middle of the night after like 12, that's why I get my cheap washing, so I just put my washing on all the time. <laughs> um, yeah, happy. Um, collecting wise, I've done, I'm, I'm doing what I've always done, pick up random bits and slowly add to the collection. But I've seen some people like um, Cyber Snake, he's um, obviously going for the full set of Mars System games. And maybe I guess what I want to achieve with this year is maybe go for a full set of something, you know? There's like, a, I don't know, probably about 70% completed on maybe Master System games, um, Sega Saturn games, Dreamcast games, so maybe we might be a bit of like, you know, might want to challenge myself, but I've just got to be, I guess I'm just going to do what I've always done. Pick and choose, pick and choose. Because I wasn't just like a one console person when I was younger, I, I just played so many video games across so many formats and that, and so many of my friends had different consoles of video games and games, yeah, video games, consoles, retro computers, about to take off man, about to take off, um, yeah, I guess that's all my, my gaming heritage, it really, is just taking the best of everything, and then, yeah, just like collecting playing games I never never played before, playing versions of consoles that might be better or might not be better, so yeah, so maybe I won't go for a full set or anything, just, just keep, on, keep on doing what I'm doing, I guess. Really? <laughs> it's going crazy out there. <laughs> okay, yeah, I best end the video. Cause fucking, I need to turn that shit off. But yeah, cheers, guys. Thanks for watching. Thanks for liking and sharing. And yeah, cheers, people. Woo -woo.